Well, last year in December, we brought you the story of a retired Army colonel who spends his holiday season working on behalf of others. Doug Terry is doing the same thing this year, using his very special talents to bring joy to everyone he meets. News 12's Bill Mitchell has tonight's Senior Matters. These videos from the Vietnam War are familiar to Doug Terry. He did 20 years in the military and 10 more as a helicopter pilot for private companies. The Alabama native has degrees in chemistry and accounting. With all that history, what would you expect him to do in retirement? That's right, he's the most realistic looking Santa we've ever seen. And when the beard grows out this time of year, he's never anybody but Santa. When you go into a restaurant or somewhere, you know, this, uh, people see you and they recognize you as Santa Claus. And, and once you assume the character Santa Claus, you know you have to stay in character. You can't come out of it, uh, you know, even in a, a restaurant. Doug says after he first grew the beard, a little girl in church stopped him to tell him what she wanted for Christmas. So he finally bought the Kris Kringle suit and let it be known that he's ready to make a few appearances. He says it taught him a lesson. There's hope. There's life. There's life after retirement. But you have to get out and look for it. They say a good Santa, or Santa's helper as most prefer, can make $30,000 during the Christmas season. Doug Terry must be really racking it up. I don't charge anything. It's just strictly a, a volunteer uh, action on my part. Uh, I do the College Dale Udawa uh, Parade. And several other appearances every year, like the News 12 annual Christmas luncheon. On another occasion, Doug visited a retirement home to see a friend. And I was in full Santa dress, so I dropped in uh, to see him. And he was not in his room, so I just kind of wandered around in the halls and wandered into a room and there were about five older people in there. And when I walked in, they're, you know, they looked sad and, and depressed. And when I walked in, their faces just lit up. And that just that makes it worthwhile just to, to see that and, and be Santa to those people. And before we close, we have to make one final request of Santa Doug Terry. Ho, ho, ho! Merry Christmas! For Senior Matters, Bill Mitchell, News 12 Now. Well, if you have an idea for a Senior Matters feature, just send us an email to news at wdef.com.